popping up on day four now, man. I'm lying to y'all. It's day five. I'm losing track of these days so fast because everything is going so quick. But I'm headed to Home Depot right now. So I'm just not pulling up to Home Depot. I got to find this guy and see where he's at. There's mad heads out here, yo. So basically right now, we're just looking for lighting for the outside. So where the logo is going to be on the building, we're trying to find lights to shine on the logo, whether that's from upwards down to the logo or from down upwards. But we're going we're gonna to look on Amazon real quick and see if they got anything better or longer pause because these are only like three feet we need about six pretty much got everything that we needed It's currently uh what like three o'clock right now the last time i saw you guys was probably one o'clock so it's two hours later um i went home and i just i ate something and i also created some stickers but now i'm on my way to go pick up the banner from king of signs and i'm actually right around the corner they're right up here my put moves at three o'clock it's currently 307 so what the hell <laughs> yo the shit you see in philly bro i swear here and i'm about to see what these signs are here for how are you good, man. <laughs> as you good? see you again you already know so you put them on both sides they're three by five i think I'm them. so you can hold there Ooh. oh my god two of these for now good enough you know that's perfect all right y'all so welcome to day six day six i we wasn't planning to do anything at all I just had my neighbor David come in to check out some of the electric work that was done inside the store previously. And surprise, surprise, everything is a messed up. So he told me that I would have to call out a uh, electrician that had some openings because he was actually booked up for the whole week. So uh, he told us everything that we had to get done and we called up a new electrician to get all the work done. So this is basically what he was telling us. Wait, my, my thing is here, mm -hmm. this is just me. I would never, in a business, I would never run 14 wire for a 15 amp circuit because you limited yourself to fucking 15 amps. Okay. This is 14 wire. The white is all 14. It's just say 14 somewhere on there. I would run everything in a yellow 12 wire. 12 two, right? Right, 12 two. Now you have 20 amps everywhere. To me, this is bullshit. 15 amp receptacle. I don't know what the fuck that is. It's supposed to be a 30, but it looks like a 50. You gotta check that. If he. It's really not a lot here. You got, you know, a receptacle there. Mm -hmm. This, I'm pretty sure you're leaving it as is, right? Yeah. If the guy comes, another guy, you can knock most of this out in a day. Okay. You know, Perfect. replace that wire, replace that box, replace that, put connectors in. Yeah, like I said, I wasn't coming and knock this out for you, bring a guy, but I just won't have the time. Nah, yeah, that's no problem. I just wanted to look at it for me. Yeah. <laughs> me personally, and even if you left this, yeah, you that, say that, fuck that, it. That should be removed anyway. Because it's, like you said, it's a, it's a, it's a um, fifteen inch. Yeah. If you're leaving it at fifteen, then put the box in you. Put the receptacle in you. I'm gonna be straight with y'all, man. Um, I don't even know what day it is. It's so bad. Um, we did miss a couple days because we did the cement, which you guys haven't seen yet, and we had to wait for it to dry. So. We did this cement two days ago, so yesterday we didn't really do much. I just had the electrician come in, look at everything, tell us what needs to be done, what don't need to be done. So today, we're pausing everything. We haven't did the plumbing yet, we haven't done the sheetrock, we haven't done nothing. Reason being, we got to get the electric, uh, electric done. And the reason why I say that, Verizon comes out tomorrow, and none of these outlets work. So we gotta replace all these outlets today, we run all these wires to make sure that the outlet work for Verizon tomorrow. So that's that's the number one priority right now. The next thing I also got to call the landlord to fix that spot. He still haven't came out to fix the water leak yet, but that got to be fixed ASAP because um, I do want some outlets back there. All right, so I just finished on the outside and what I'm basically doing I'm going around the perimeter of the building and inside the building and any loose wires or any wires that's not in use no more, I'm just clipping them or taking them down, all the signs on the building, 
taking those down too. I'm basically getting the building prepped for paint because we're about to start painting soon. So the little stuff that I can do, I'm just running around, make sure I get them done real quick. Uh, so we don't got to worry about it at all. But we moving and grooving. I'm waiting on Daytona J to get over here so we could freaking go to Home Depot. Uh, this is what I was telling you guys about with that West spot. The guys just came to fill that patch in the back to make sure the roof is not leaking no more. We just leave at Home Depot. We got the drywall right here. Huge shout out to Speed to Speed Enterprise for helping me with my delivery. So we got 10 drywalls. Still got five more we gotta pick up. And then in the back seat, we got a couple items as well. Uh, back here, we got the drywall tape, the drywall screws. We got a couple of outlets, uh, switches, uh, plumbing fitting, and the boxes, the electrical boxes. Uh, we also got some straps too. So we're about to head back to the shop now. down the other walls the bathroom walls the wall over here up there was teared down as well and all this down here all teared out um we tore everything out because it's like might as well just make everything all in one trash pile take everything out so now we just gotta re-go or re-install everything now y'all like that look at this right here this is a window i don't know how the hell you open this or whatever but this used to be a window right here. That's fucking insulation right there behind it. And then also in here, there's a door. Fucking all kind of magical shit in this motherfucker. That's a door right there. So that was an entrance before. That was a window before. And then everything else is sealed up. This bathroom wasn't here. So they recently, well not recently, but whenever they decide to make this, this is an addition to the building. And then there's a window right here. Uh -huh, that window go outside. And then that pipe right there go to the spigot outside. But yeah, uh, everything is completed on today. Uh, it was a little bit more demolition, uh, like y'all saw. Uh, just getting everything out, bagging everything up, trashing it. Uh, the electrician is coming out tomorrow to start the wiring. And then also they left this box live for Verizon. Uh, there's a switch in here that we gotta make sure it's the red switch at the top, make sure it's on for Verizon. And then these three wires right here that you see, that goes to that pole right there. Y'all see that red pole? That's the power to that red pole, which is this. So we lit, but this is gonna be look completely different tomorrow. Y'all see all spaghetti right now. It ain't gonna look like that tomorrow. And yeah. Next thing is electrical sheet, electrical plumbing sheetrock. Electrical plumbing sheetrock. Now, what are we getting done tomorrow? Tomorrow, electrical and plumbing. Electrical and plumbing, I love it. I don't think y'all understand. I'm stressing out right now, right? But the only reason I'm stressing out because I'm trying to get anything done by June 1st. From what JR is telling me, it's more than possible. But right now, with me looking at everything, it's like, bro, I don't know. We stretching it. But, you know, it's starting to, I'm starting to see the vision of how everything is looking. And the way everybody's explaining th uh, things to me, I'm piecing it in my mind. So, we gonna see. So right now, we checking the drain for all the sewer, what you call it? Oh, the sewer pipe right here. The That's sewer pipe. Yeah. To make sure it's not clogged up or nothing. So he's just shooting water down there to see if it squirts back up. Back up. But it seems like it's good. Lift that up yeah. a little bit. Water. Yeah, y'all can see the water running in there. And it seems like it's good. No water is flowing back up or nothing. Oh, shit. Because the water ain't going to be running that long anyway, but we just making sure. Yeah. And it seems to be so we're thinking about cutting it from the V 
all the way straight across. Right yeah. Looking for 1100? 1100? Yes. Shit, okay. Yeah, the reason is, you see the wire right there? Yeah. It's the wire. We have to be careful, you know? Yeah. Up little by little right there. Uh, the branch is too longer. You see, this is longer branches. How soon How soon you think you guys can get it done? Like, uh, you see, you know, like a Thursday. Thursday? Yes. Okay. All right, so we're pretty much done for today. Probably going, well, not probably. We are coming back tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow is the electrician and plumbing. We got the bathroom all taken care of. So that's completely gutted out. Um, and everything else, Gucci. That's that. That's a wrap on day what? Seven? We on day seven? Alright, so it's now uh, day. Yes. <laughs> Whatever this is, that's what day it is. Uh, we got uh, Verizon out here. Verizon is uh, hooking up our internet and business phone. And then after they finish that, the electrician is gonna come and fix all the wiring and shit. So that's Gucci. So we at the end of day eight. Talk to me. All right, boom. Drain. New drain. Instead of coming out of there, because they had one pipe, everything was coming out the wall. Uh -huh. Now everything's flushed into the wall. Nice. Left hot, blue, I mean, right cold, pexed all around, strapped up. Boom. This is leading to uh, this pipe right here. Those two copper pipes leads back into your uh, bathroom. bathroom, which leads into your uh, hot water heater. Okay. Um, your water meter tucked into the wall. There's gonna be a uh, access panel sticking out. Okay. Hand sink gonna be attached to here with the drain sticking into here, going into the main stack pipe, which is the breathable slash vent, going down into the straight drain. Main drain. After that, a couple of walls, and it's a wrap. That's it. Sheet rock. I like that. Oh, yeah. Also, all right, so let me explain to y'all. Today we finished out the electrical. Uh, we got the two game box over there, two game box. You got single boxes around different places. Uh, we got four singles on this wall. You guys can't see it. And then we got, uh, yeah, right back there. All four single boxes are, are in. Uh, is this a three game box? This is, uh, I think it's a three game. One, two, yep, three gang. Three gang. Uh, that's for the switches when we come inside. So it's going to be a switch for the floodlights right here because we're going to have recess lights. Then it's a switch for that light, which is going to be in the middle. 
then there's going to be a switch for the outside lights, which is going to be going around the building. Um, and then also, I don't know if it's going to be on. Oh, it's going to be a switch in there for the box that's going to be up there. Um, so, yeah, the electrical is done. Uh, we got these lights in here temporarily because we need to see what the fuck we know. Huh? Um, what's the game plan for tomorrow? Game plan. Close out plumbing. plumbing sheet rock. Then just wait for the fixtures. Say that. Are we chilling? Well, I'm, I'm going to connect the big light and just have it up there. That one? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to have it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Exactly. And then just let him do the rest of his thing. Who? Um, the electrician. He oh, done. He yeah. Oh, he done. The only thing that they got to do is wire the box up. All right, so I can put my fixtures up myself and all. Yeah. All right, yeah, this. bro. Okay. You know, sometimes they be specific. They want to come put their fixtures nah. up. All right, say less. That shit clip. Uh, he said it's a brand. Yeah, they uh, done done. Uh, say less. Uh, All right, so I can just bring me my motherfucking lights and shit, and they gonna go right up the little flush mounts. Yeah. They gonna go grab those. They about sixteen dollars for the four. Okay. You know what I mean? Say that. And yeah. they're bright, bright. You get you get the three colors. Are they dimmers? They. Because we got a dimmer. You can set a dimmer on here. Yeah, we have one. One of those switches is a dimmer. So you can set that dimmer to that one. Okay. So and they will dim. Just tell me. Yeah, of course. Okay. Day is a wrap. <laughs>